Yeah, let's do more of this. If you are checking this out later as a replay, thanks for clicking the video. Uh, I'm just thinking what I'm doing today. I've got the house to continue. Um, there's one more house to do. And then I guess clean up the island? I don't know. Start of the Lunar New Year. I should probably check if there's any seasonal items or something. Oh yeah, and KK's here. Okay. There's probably items that are... That's on Monday, the Festival. Hmm. Well. Let's leave that be. Yeah, let me see. So I get the stuff. Got Sonata. All right. Throw away. Throw away. Oh, I gotta remember to do this. This might take a minute. stuff first. I gotta go buy a watering can because I don't have one currently, I don't think. Yeah. so far. Uh, eh, nothing really I want here. Yeah, I'm good. Give me a watering can.
This looks good. Build no duplication. Hmm. can do is just keep doing that. Alright, what is this recipe? Probably have to change the plans here now. I just want to get through the daily stuff quickly. How's this looking now? Ah, uh, okay, yeah. Cool. Probably should have gone for a green roof, but you know what? It's fine. I can change it if I want later. It does bother me, but I think everything else is fine. It fits. Yeah, I should have gone green roof. Oh well. I will change it later. Still, the rest of it looks good. Alright, let me do the obligatory outfit change so then my thumbnails look different. Oh, I had the army hat. I'm gonna go put on the army hat. Ow. Oh. Damn, I kind of want that too. Hey, Vana Beans, how's it going? Uh, I'll go with this for now and then I'll, I'll see what I have at home. I might buy the power suit. Remember, I think I went green. Ah! Whoops. I was trying to go for my drink and then my finger slipped. Don't wear it. Good, about to play. What are you going to do today? I am going to most likely work on my final house. So I need to redecorate, but I need to do a bunch of things first. Wait, not that one. Why does the D-pad have to be so weird sometimes? Okay. I can't remember if I ordered something overnight that I was going to place. What have I got on me? Oh, right, these things. Yep, yep. Alright, I have to go to halves anyway. These are just for later.
Wait, when it says flower bed. Right. <laughs> okay. Uh I don't know. It's a bad for me to expect like a bed made out of flowers. Or a bed that you sleep in that looks like flowers. Anyway. That's going there. There we go. That was the thing I ordered overnight. <sighs> I should have made the roof green. I'm, I'm regretting it. I'll have to change it in a couple days. But everything else looks nice. I thought it would suit better. Everything else is fine, it's just... Yeah, a bit of an oversight. Alright. I'm going to halves. Going to work. Also, screen is loading. Hang on, I'm going to turn up the air conditioning. It's pretty warm here. Tomorrow it's going to be ridiculous. That's gonna be 38 celsius which what does that convert to in fahrenheit i gotta get better at converting the fahrenheit a hundred all right so i thought a hundred yeah a hundred which it could be worse but it's gonna be a few days of that i'll do it when i go to halves Where's my bottle? There it is. Okay. Keep, I keep finding this one. Okay. Bad luck. Only the Daily Island can save me now. I do want to put in an order here today, so... I get the feeling he's gonna run out of recipes now. Apparently, yes. <laughs> I'm sure there's something I haven't gotten. This looks like Rafiki, only just built, built up. I don't think I'll ever get the, uh, the doghouse. <laughs> I tried doing so many homes where the theme was oriented around pets and it just never made it available for purchase. Okay, uh... I'm gonna get some box stools.
Okay, those are the colors. I'll probably go with yellow. And I'll just order five of them. Okay. Where I have my theater, I'm gonna place them as like a bit of a waiting area. All right, now I can go to halves. And whilst it does that, I'll quickly turn up the air conditioning. Hopefully, be better. Uh, no, nah, it's fake. I can see the wristwatch. Am I streaming on something else as well? Uh, I got it on YouTube because you're allowed to do that nowadays, but. That's just so people have the option. Primarily, it's it's here. I do have a TikTok account, but it's not quite at the point yet where I can stream to that. I think it's like 300 followers off and then I can apply for a stream key. But uh, I think the way Twitch has it is if you want to go to multiple platforms like YouTube, you have to like say that you're chatting here primarily, like that's the only condition. Which is weird, because for TikTok you don't have to do that, I don't know. They're a bit inconsistent. Okay, so these are going to be intended as show bags. Which I'm not sure is like a universal thing, but... Okay, get that. We'll get a few different designs. Yeah, I'll just do it to give people the option. I mean, I kind of like YouTube more if I'm watching it on the TV, because Twitch's video player on the TV sucks. It, it does. I'm an idiot. I thought it was already done. Uh, let's see. What else? I think the, the number one thing that I don't like about the Twitch TV app... ...is... ...it'll... ...it'll do this thing, like... ...when you go to someone's profile... The unfollow button, it's so it's so weird. The button to actually watch the stream is on the right hand side, and then every other button is like unfollow, block, report, and those are the things that are highlighted by default. And there are so many times where I almost accidentally like click unfollow when I really mean I want to watch the stream. I don't know. My job involves designing interfaces, so it, it like <laughs> it kills me every time I see it. Do that. The phone app's gotten better. The phone app used to be a lot worse, but they have improved it. Still prefer YouTube, though. But the chat experience on YouTube, admittedly, is, is not great, and going live is a bit of a hassle. Figure out which ones I'm gonna use. Ooh, 
Loom lamp, table lamp, tea set, spray can, simple panel, eh. Most of the people you watch are on YouTube, so you don't have to deal with that often. Oh, okay. Yeah, I mean, I, I tried YouTube streaming last year. And, I mean, I think the main problem is people didn't realize I was live. But this year I've started just making random little videos about me talking about stuff. Games that I play in. It's gotten better. I don't know, maybe it'll improve over there over time. I tend to watch more YouTube than Twitch as well, but I do watch certain streamers on Twitch. I think the main thing is because I got YouTube Premium, ha not having ads. Oh, man. I think that's the best part. Who do I watch? Um, on Twitch, typically. Uh, German 985, Vine Source, Vinny, I guess, specifically. And then random streamer friends. On YouTube, every now and then I, I, I check out, like, Ludwig and people close to Ludwig. Just that kind of group. Oh, wow. Oh, it is struggling with my island. I don't know what it is. Is it the flowers or is it a particular thing? It's when I whenever I walk past this part here, it, it just it struggles. You love Ludwig and those people, yeah. They're good people and they're funny to watch. Yeah. Pretty genuine people, so that's why I enjoy watching them. Yeah, I don't know. I give up. <laughs> I don't know what. We need we need a new Nintendo console. Just anyway. I'm just gonna set this up as like a stall where you get show bags. It's a thing here where if you go to like a a public event that has rides or like a, a carnival or I don't know, like even some circuses have them. There's just these bags that are full of candy and then random junk. They're expensive, but they usually pack in one thing where you're like, oh man, I kinda want that. There you go. I'll just make that uh, a stall for that. I wasn't sure what to do with it, and then I remembered. Yeah, that'll do. All right. Uh, the only other thing I'm gonna do before I start decorating. So the job today is gonna be here. I'm probably gonna rearrange things. So then I can put some semblance of furniture or something, because as nice as this is, it's just flowers and nothing else, so I'll figure it out. Uh, and then decorating the house. But first I gotta go to the Daily Island and just get the recipe. Never seen show bags anywhere, but you don't have carnivals around. Oh, okay. Yeah, I mean, I'm not sure if it's just an Australian thing. I, I should probably ask others. But they're not worth it. It's like... They package in maybe $3 worth of candy, and then where they get you is like, they'll include something that you want, like a little plushie or a nice, uh, like, pop culture thing. Just something where you're like, oh, that thing is so cool, or it's cute, I want it. And so you pay, like, you pay like twenty dollars for the damn bag to get two dollars of candy in the one item that you could probably find elsewhere for a couple of bucks. It's just 
But I guess when you're younger, uh, yeah. Yeah. I did get like some cool stuff out of it. But they are they are expensive. You live in America? Oh, okay. I'm guessing by the time zone, like um somewhere west coast ish. Unless you're up super duper late. Do I have camo pants? I don't think I do. Go like polar opposites. You know what? I might just do this. This is fine. Where is it? I got gifted it yesterday. I've probably gone past it. I would love to see someone in the military wear this exact outfit. Yeah, there it is. 12.35 a.m. Okay, that's not too bad. That's okay, it's within the realm. Oh, you can't have duck in. Okay. Excuse me for wanted like a bearded duck. They're in Texas. Ah, oh, okay, cool. I don't think I have any viewers from Texas, so this is a first. It's one of the city, well, the cities in Texas that I want to go to. Yeah, military duck man. <laughs> but I want something else. You know what, that's fine. Military duck with dreams. fit in with Scoot. Because I've had good things about, like, um, Austin. I think the heat's getting to me. I'm not, like, speaking properly. <laughs> I almost said city of Texas. And I'm like, no, don't say that. That's bad. It's not a city. I was supposed to say, there are cities in Texas. Yeah, primarily Austin. Never been to Austin, but you've been near there. I just like to visit places where there's good food. Just sign me up for all of that stuff. Okay, this this is gonna look extra cool. <laughs> Looks like I'm being transported to battle. small city so the food isn't great ah but if i was to say to visit if you were to pick a food that you'd be like all right you know what this food here this is the best we can do it's actually pretty good what would it be I like to keep good food that people recommend in mind, because it's, it's an easy way to get to know people, is just through food. Because then if I come across it and try it, then I can be like, oh yeah, I tried that. Wait, oh. I have not gotten this island before, it's Money Tree Island. <laughs> I was about to get the bottle and just leave. I mean, not that I need the money, but, like, it's 
still. Is this set in a different time of year? Brisket? Oh man, I love me a good brisket. Deep fried ribs? Deep fried ribs. Can't say I've had those. But it sounds amazing. Every time I, I have food from America, and even though it's like the Australian version of it, I just feel like, oh man, I, I, I need to fall asleep immediately afterwards. I had a chili dog for the first time last year and it, it knocked me out for a whole afternoon. I need to go back to that place and try it. They have a mac and cheese dog, which is basically the same as how it sounds like. Except it has bacon on top of the mac and cheese as well. It's just... I can feel my arteries clogging up just thinking about it. But it's so good. You don't normally eat chili dogs. So hot dogs here, they're not really that... Common. Which is kind of a shame. Like, I wish we had more places to get good hot dogs. That They exist, but you kind of have to go out of your way. Um, probably the one food there's not too many of. Like, I think I know of three different places in the city. They're good, I, I like them, but man. <laughs> Just, I need to sleep afterwards. You can get pretty much anything here, you just have to look for it. I'm kind of spoiled when it comes to food choice. Might as well get these on here. Okay, is that everything? I mean, I should probably check the rocks. I bet they're loaded. like to try fruits from other countries. Oh, yeah. Do you have any country in particular you want to try? I grew up in a pretty multicultural area here in Australia. So I've just gotten to know so many different types of food. Japan. Oh, yeah, that's one of the greats. I want to go to Japan and just go sit at a ramen place and eat ramen. I can get it here, but I wanna, I wanna try it like straight from the horses now. I think the best ramen I've had here, they did like a whiskey infused ramen. So the broth had like, I don't know how they did it, but it was like pork and then it was infused with whiskey. It was so damn good. Never had any from a restaurant. Yeah, hopefully you can find some. The first time I, I had proper ramen, it was like a life-changing experience. Oh, 
I was I was so happy. <laughs> just a sense of calm just came over me after I ate. There was a small place as well. They didn't really have many seats. It was almost like straight out of an anime. Just like late at night, there's some old dude in the kitchen cooking some ramen and some stools at the counter. Just pulled up a seat and I was like, what do you recommend? And made me a bowl and that bowl was just magical. There are restaurants that sell it. Just never been to any. Oh, okay. Should try it. Highly recommend. Or like um, they do the the omelet rice. Oh man, the omelet rice is so good. Hmm. I want anything from here. Hang on. I might bring some hedges with me, because I think I might use some. Like egg and rice. So, it's an omelette that they top with, um, I don't know what it is, it's almost like a ketchup. But they also do like a curry one, it's like a pretty light curry. And then there's just fried rice underneath it, a bed of fried rice that has some fixings. So the idea is you get it and then you kind of mix the omelette into the rice and it just becomes like a nice fried rice. But the presentation's cool. Like, you'd be surprised. I thought, hmm, ketchup on an omelette, that's strange, but it works. But the version I usually get is, like, the curry. Japanese curry is different to, say, an Indian curry. Ew. Don't like the idea of what? The ketchup? The egg? The curry? I don't like ketchup with eggs. Yeah, get the curry version. I don't think the ketchup version's that good. The curry version's much better. You can also get it plain as well. The plain's good too. haven't tried curry. Curry is an interesting one because there's Indian curry which can be pretty strong and then there's more Southeast Asian curry which is milder. So it depends if you're into spicy stuff or not. I like Japanese curry more. Have mainly barbecued fast food and seafood, but oh, that's still good stuff. Love me some good barbecue. Might use that. I decided against getting the hedges. I can just grow them, it's fine. Alright, let me think about this. What furniture have I got available to me?
<laughs> okay, so that's what I have. I think I'm gonna mess around with the layout first before going too far. Okay, but I think I have like a loose idea. You're hoping for crab legs soon, but everything's expensive. Yeah, I was talking to someone, uh, a viewer from New York, and they were talking about just how expensive food is. And I, it's food is expensive here, but by comparison, I was like, what the hell is going on over there? They were saying just to get two pizzas or, and one other thing, I forgot what it was, delivered, it was 60 bucks. Stuff has gotten expensive here, but not to that level. Inflation and shrinkflation. My favorite potato chips. Could easily get them for three dollars Australian, and now just the uh, six bucks, and the bag is smaller. Every state is different. Okay, that's fair. If you were getting two pizzas, how much would it cost you? Get delivery. Okay. <laughs> Average it out, I think. Alright, this fence is going. Four forty. Oh man. Yeah, that's still that's still so expensive. I forgot the conversion, but... So, there's... I live pretty close to the Italian district, so there are fancy Italian restaurants. And so to get... Hang on. Figure it out again. Yeah, so... To go to, to go to a fancy Italian restaurant and get two pizzas from one of those restaurants... It's $39 US, and that includes tax, and you don't tip in Australia, because we don't do that here. And that's now. <laughs> it used to be cheaper. Yeah, okay. I, I guess I, I can't complain too much when I say food's expensive. Okay. over there. That's distracting. You're going to a fancy place tomorrow for your mom's birthday? Oh, what are you going to do? I wait for this balloon, which will probably contain, like, clay or something. Every time I'm waiting around for a balloon, it, it, it's clay. But one of them will contain the recipe I'm looking for. I can feel it. eating tomorrow. 
Okay. What kind of fancy food are you gonna have? I need to look up what song I need to request. Balloons never give you what you need. I have mixed luck. If I'm looking for something, it'll disappear off the face of the earth. But, if I'm not looking for something, I can be pretty lucky. I'll get good items. Kind of a shame I have to take off my helmet, but it's okay. The place is like Cajun Italian or something. Cajun Italian? What kind of food is that? Is it just like a fusion of Italian and then spicy stuff? I used to love the pro controller, but over time my, my opinion of it has just gone down the drain. Cajun seafood, they have a lot of pasta type dishes and a lot of fancy dishes. Oh, okay. That's cool. I've been to a Cajun seafood place once. It was, it was good. Admittedly, they, they took a while. They had a really bad night, but the food was good. this somehow. Okay, hang on. How many purples do we have? There's six purple flowers. And there's eight this near. It's not gonna work. I want to think of a layout that gives me more room for stuff. Pretty good, you go a couple times a year. Yeah, it sounds nice. A lot of my, my family and friends are not that adventurous, so they kind of stick to favorites and then they don't really go outside of that comfort zone too much. Okay, so let me think about this. Uh, so the three spots here. I think this is gonna have to remain. It's more this is where I have the freedom. You're getting tenders and fried shrimp. That's a good combo. Demolish a plate of that. Sign me up for anything that involves chicken. I don't think I have much of a choice because the blue rises are going to go here. I mean, this is good. I'm trying to think how I can maximize space.
I don't think I can plant it here because it gets in the way of the door. Okay. I think at the very least... Also, a grid of six. Aha! Uh -huh. Okay, okay, I got this, I got this. I'm altering it again. They have the best fried shrimp too. Yeah, can't go wrong with good fried shrimp. Every time I stream it, I swear, the conversation goes to food. And then I'm just sitting here like, man, I could really go for that. It's okay, I'll survive. Decorate your museum area. You got any ideas? All I did with mine was place a cafe and then I guess just made it look like it was one big thing. I might revisit it at the end. I'm not sure. Yeah, food's an easy way to talk to people. Can't go wrong. I'd rather talk about food than be like, so how's the weather? Do I even have an end goal <laughs> with this? Yeah. I'm nearly done. Every house has gotten like a style to it. Specifically for this, um... Not really, I'm kind of winging it. I'm just getting more space. <laughs> Are you doing a space thing with the Celeste items? Is that cool? Yeah. I'd like the space items, they do nice lighting. How are things anyway, confirming? I think in a couple of weeks I'll be done with this island. We have Fruity Pebbles in Australia. We don't. That was my favorite cereal growing up. And then they got rid of it because it contains some something in it that uh, it's a food additive they made illegal in Australia and other countries around the world. It's just one of those things where if you have too much of it, it can cause problems. Yeah, it was, it was some... something. I don't know what it was, specifically. <laughs> but... It disappeared suddenly. Yeah. Do we have any good cereal? So, our cereal here... It tends to lean more on the side of, um, cereal that is intended for older people. Candy cereal is not really a thing here. You can definitely find it. But it's, yeah, it's, it's rare. 
I think probably one of the better ones we have is this thing called Milo. It's like a, a malt powder that uh, they sell. And they do a bunch of stuff with it. Like, they do ice cream, they do, um, like, candy bars. But they also do a cereal, so it's like a malted cereal. Like oats. Yeah, I mean, just stuff like Honey Nut, where it's like a cornflake adjacent thing. And then it might have some fruit and nuts. Um, or like those wheat parcel things, except it doesn't have the frosted sugar on it or anything like that. It's just fruit on the inside. We do have um, Rice Krispies, which we call uh, Rice Bubbles. And, uh... Yeah. Fruit Loops. Outside of that, you can get American cereal. You just have to go to, like, a place that sells it. It's pretty boring. <laughs> just no candy cereals here. But I can understand why. Okay, so now I have... Just have these two to place somewhere. Your favorite sugary cereal is Cinnamon Toast Crunch, but you also like things like Raisin Bran. Okay. The cereal that I've been recommended is Captain Crunch. Like, it's probably the one that I've heard people say, hey, try that if you're going to try a cereal. But everyone has their own taste, so I don't know. This will work. Alright, I'm more confident with this layout now because now there's more room. Captain Crunch doesn't do it to for you. What does it taste like? That's the one thing I've never had answered. Is what 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 is it exactly? Your mom likes a peanut butter one. See, that's wild to me. Like, it's a cereal that's peanut butter related. It's just not a thing. But we have our share of stuff that's, like, strange here, so... I mean, look, Vegemite's a meme. That's... it's the reason people talk about Vegemite is just because the way they eat it is wrong. They fall for the trap where they treat it like it's a peanut butter, and that's not how it's supposed to be eaten. Don't try Vegemite. There, there are plenty of other things Australia has to offer that is infinitely better than that. Vegemite is, a, is like one of these things that... It's fine. It's a flavor enhancer that people use in cooking as well. But I wouldn't say, like, if you want to try the best of what Australia has to offer, to try that. It's just... Eh, it's infamous more than anything else. What is Vegemite? It's a yeast-based bread that uh, you get toast, you get some butter, you slather your toast in butter, and then I mean like the thinnest smear of Vegemite you put on top of it, like 
very, very small amount. Just so it colors your toast. So it just adds flavor. It's, yeah, <laughs> like, it's just infamous, that's all it is. Yeast spread, no thanks. I mean, bread is yeast, it has yeast in it. I can tell you that when it's used to make, like, steak sauces or there are certain soups where you add a bit of it, it does taste good because it's just salty. What would I suggest to try? Okay. I mean, I talked about this yesterday, but, um... One that you can relatively easily make is fairy bread. That's a staple for, uh... If you're going to elementary school and there's a birthday. Instead of getting birthday cake and spending a bunch of money, some schools will just do this, so... You get white bread. The cheaper the white bread, the better. Just white bread. Um... You get... So we call it margarine, but it is... A, it is a... It is vegetable shortening. It's like made out of canola oil. So it's like canola shortening. I don't know how else to put it, but it's like a spread. It's a canola spread, okay? Substitute for butter. You spread it on your, your slice of bread. Not toasted, just plain slice of bread. And, uh, you want to use, like, a pretty liberal amount of it, right? Like, not as thick as peanut butter, but not too thin. And then you get rainbow sprinkles. And just cover the slice of bread in rainbow sprinkles. It's what you call butter, but it's not butter, though. There's no dairy in it. It's, like, made out of canola oil. We have butter as well, but it's... There's butter and then there's that. But the point is, um, the sprinkles mix in and it makes like this makeshift icing flavor. So, it, it's cool. It, it tastes good. Uh, where's my picture of it? I was talking about this yesterday. Yeah, it looks like that. Very simple, you'd be surprised how good it tastes. I think it would be good toasted. Uh, I think when it toasts, it might become a bit of a mess. You could try it. I, I can't vouch for it. But I know the result is uh, the spread and the sprinkles kind of taste like icing. It's like a very easy way to make icing. Uh, but if you want things to pick up, not a sweets person, then you probably won't like Tim Tams, but Tim Tams are like our best thing that we export. We also have this, um... So they primarily make rum. It's a company that makes rum, but they also make, uh, they make sodas. So they do a, a ginger beer that is insanely good. Can't recommend it more. And I, and you can find it in the US, it just depends. Uh, it's called Bundaberg. It's spelled B-U-N-D-A-B-E-R-G. Uh, you'll know it when you see a white polar bear on the label. And it's a ginger beer, so. They also do rum. But any, 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 uh, soda that they make is, is legit. Very legit. It comes in a glass bottle. They have different flavors. The ginger beer is the more known one, but they also have, um, like a pina colada, not a... Not an alcoholic one. Uh, they have like, what, guava and grapefruit. I think they even have like a lemon and coconut one as well, which is pretty decent. But it's good. 
Are you the first one here? Uh, not really. Primarily, like, I'm, I'm talking on Twitch. So there's a bunch of people in Twitch chat I'm talking to. On YouTube, maybe. <laughs> I don't know. I haven't looked. We have to appease the gods at Twitch. That may be. Alright, anyway. Uh, I'm thinking about the fencing that I'm going to put here. Or whether to keep it open. I think what I might do, I might try and work on some implied fencing, so... I'll go move this tree and others. I'm a fan of implied fencing. The one, the stuff that I would recommend in terms of food, this is more like if you ever get a chance to try it. Uh, kangaroo. That might sound weird, and I promise you I'm not trolling you, but... We eat kangaroo here, and it's pretty good. But also, um, I mean, the staple when you go to, like, a sports game is a... It's the size of a, a pot pie. It's like a small pie, but it has meat in it. So it's, like, typically steak meat and gravy. And you put ketchup on it, and it's, it's just... It's out of this world. It's great. It's, you just eat it. Almost like a hot dog. It's in your hand, and then you just bite into it. Yeah, that's that's one where you would probably have to come to Australia, unless there's some place that imports foods frozen, because you, you do get them frozen at the supermarket here. So it's possible that they might export them. But that is... That is a good one. Oh, snack foods. Um, we have Cheetos that are... They're Cheeto balls. And they have different flavors, but the main one that people get are cheese and bacon Cheetos. Cheese and bacon Cheeto balls. <laughs> that you can probably find. Yeah, they're, they're cheese balls, but the cheese and bacon. And they're Cheeto branded. Like, I know those are specific to Australia. You can probably find them in another brand, but... The Cheeto brand. Okay, implied fencing. Let's go... do actual fencing this way. Polypenia cheetahs, cheetahs are good. Oh, that sounds awesome. I'll have to look for those. That's the one thing I'm envious of, is just, we don't have many snack varieties. We only got a second flavor of Mountain Dew just only a few years back. Before that, it was just the one flavor. And I would just see just all the different varieties that were available. I'm like, why can't we have that here? They aren't spicy, but they have a good flavor. Oh, it's fine. I like my spicy stuff, but I also will forego spice to get good flavor. You have so many and they aren't good. <laughs> the one that we got, um, which is kind of decent, it's like a sugar-free watermelon flavor. It's a, it's a very candy watermelon flavor, but it's pretty good. After so many years of just having the green one and nothing else.
I still- Baja Blast is like my white whale. I want to try it. I know some say it's like overrated, and I, I get that, but it's just- I'm intrigued. Taco Bell opened in Australia a few years back, and they did not bring Baja Blast at all. Which defeats the purpose of going to Taco Bell, in my opinion, for me. Like, I know people like it, but... Look, when you grow up in... In a house where, like, there's South and Central American food... I don't know, I just can't help but hear my mom in my ear just saying, Hey, what are you doing paying for this? Come home, I'll make you, like, a proper taco or burrito or whatever. Don't care for Taco Bell. That's fair. I can't judge it. Because I haven't tried it. I just want I just want to try the Baja Blast, that's all. You can find places that sell it, but the price they're charging is insane. Like, 30, 40 bucks for just six cans of it. Which, I want to try it, but I don't want to try it that badly. Okay, uh, I need hedges. Yeah, that'll do. Hang on. Red. Red, okay. I only have red. It's worth a try, but not a need. Okay. I guess it just comes from the fact that... <laughs> I only had one flavor of Mountain Dew for the longest amount of time, so anything that was different, I was like, yo, that's cool, I want to try it. Probably just putting it up on the pedestal too much. Uh, okay, hold on. for man and do. Yeah, I mean, it's alright. I, I wouldn't say it's something that I'll go out of my way for. Oh, there is there is a drink that... So it's owned by Pepsi, but I, I think they don't sell it anywhere outside of Australia and New Zealand. I might be wrong. But it's called Solo. So it's... It's a lemon, it's a lemon drink. It's not a lemonade. It's like, it's a crushed lemon drink. It's hard to explain without having tried it. But it's, it's refreshing as, as hell. Root beer is your favorite. Root beer is good. It's a cold solo, like Han Solo, S O L O, and it's lemon solo lemon drink. That's what you need to probably look up because I think there's a solo in Europe, but it's not the same thing. You'll know that you found it if it's like some Aussie dude doing sports and is all sweaty and then just drinks some solo. <laughs> That's usually their commercials. 
extreme sports, someone being really sweaty and then they just slam a solo and they're refreshed. I'm gonna try something. So I don't wanna do all of this. I mean, this is probably not a bad idea. Hang on. It kind of loses its, its impact. I was just messing around with the idea if, like, I had stalls on the inside here. Yeah, it's probably not the best. It's okay. Uh, which it's the wrong way, right? Yep. <laughs> Come on. The starters. Yeah, go with something different. Okay. Yeah, cool. That'll do. I did have that display cabinet with flowers. I might get that out. have a dream address. Not yet. Uh, I'm going to do that at the end. One thing. I like to share stuff once I'm done. That's just, it's me. The me thing. Eventually I'll do it. Uh, okay. That's good there. Add a flower bed here. And then I might put some seating here. What else can I put here? I might just random little furniture. I'll see what I have. Particularly because there's things about the island that's like... Okay, there's things that look nice, but then... I mean, this is just a joke, this thing here. I don't care if people don't understand that one. But... This. All, all this here, it's like, what is he doing? Why does he have all these flowers everywhere? Just... I like his island, but his beach? What's going on with his beach? That's a very lazy beach. I should probably check if they're crafting while I'm here. Oh, you're not.
but I will I will definitely uh set one up before I'm done with this. I think they're all here and it's unlikely anyone's gonna be crafting anyway. You have a flower walkway between your cliffs. A flower walkway? So just a line of flowers as far as the eye can see. One thing I wish I was better at is doing flower arrangements. I've seen some pretty nice ones. Very big, but yes, gotcha. Oh, I'm, I'm just ruining everything now. <laughs> I'm picking the wrong thing. There we go. Okay. Wait, I'm doing it. I'm doing it again. What is wrong with me? There we go. It leads to a hidden beach area. That must be really nice. I got a mental picture of it. Oh, it's not very big. <laughs> okay. Mental picture adjusted. A lot of the times I have ideas in my head and then I just have to translate it over. I mean, is it lazy of me if I use the bistro table again? Jeez, the loading here. I like the table. It's just the only complaint I have of it is just... I don't know why on the side it, it just looks awkward. You like to find ideas on Pinterest? Pinterest is good. A lot of the patterns that I got were from there. In terms of ideas themselves, I've tried to do everything myself. There would have been some mild inspiration from the patterns, because they had pictures of how they were used. But other than that... Let me see. I think I have to customize this, because otherwise it just looks too identical. Oh, okay. <laughs> Can't squeeze in there. I mean, this is working how I wanted it to. It's 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 like an implied fence. Okay, if I say you get back. Yeah, that looks too identical. It is identical, in fact. I'm gonna go change it. It's okay. I might use different chairs as well, and not the cool seats, so let's see what I have. <laughs> oh my god. No. Okay. That was embarrassing. And it's just for a nurse's jacket. Okay. I think my proudest idea is what I did with, um, 
the gyroids. Inside my house where they're just like the uh the bar patrons. Are kind of nice. I know you can't customize them much, but probably use that. Wish you didn't have snow on your island. Sometimes I forget that. <laughs> Just people are experiencing snow right now. And I get pictures sent to me, and it's just of snow everywhere, and it just feels like they're living on a completely different planet to me. But I guess it's the same during Christmas time here. I'm like talking about wearing shorts and just having summer related things. Go halve. One day I'll experience a real winter. I've experienced snow, but it's like Australian snow. It, it doesn't count. Australian snow is for a couple of weeks in August. They're like, oh, it's a beautiful snow season. Come down to this mountain that's like four hours away. And you better hurry because by next weekend it's gone. <laughs> and then it's back to rain. It, it doesn't count. They have to use snow machines a lot. There's no snow physically because Texas, but Animal Crossing Island there is. Oh, okay. Have I experienced winter? I don't think I've played when winter is in game. I may have. What do you do in winter? Yeah, I don't think I've played in winter, because I can't think of the activities you do. I know you make a snowman, but I haven't done that. Okay, so Daisy has these kind of colors. It's like blue, purple. We'll do that. It's a nice pattern. Let me just see what's available here. Yeah, too bright. Okay. Then reception chair. I think that it'll work like that. Oh, that's fine. White ones. At first it's like, wow, pretty, then it gets boring and you're just ready for green again, because everything is all white. <laughs> I like spring the most in terms of the seasons in this game. Just... The cherry blossom part of it looks cool. I mean, summer, when the game first came out, was really good, because... Uh... That was the season that I started off in, when the game released. So I had sharks on my island, and people were just visiting it because they wanted sharks. So that was, that was an advantage to summer, but... Spring is the nicest looking season. If I had a choice, I could... I would stay in that season. Okay, uh... Easter table... Yes. 
perception check. What? Yeah, that's totally where I want it to go. Thank you, game. <laughs> I don't know if it's just me, but just I feel so inaccurate with placing things sometimes. Okay, um... room, isn't there? I had this here before, what happened? Alright, I might have to move it down one. The game does what it wants, yeah. <laughs> I have noticed that. But every time it happens to me, I just think, oh man, come on, you can do better. I don't think I can push it any further. I mean, that's fine. So, as long as I can cut through somewhere, I can cut through here. Okay, so that's that. I'll grind some Nook Miles to get another flower bed. I'll put it here. Okay, uh, I'm gonna just see what else I got. I might put like a statue or something or... Okay, I have an idea for other things to place here. I'll buy some garden gnomes. For a garden place. That makes sense. They sell garden gnomes. I don't think I've bought the regular ones. <laughs> the only gnomes I have are these ones, which I'm using as security. Yeah, I think two is enough, right? Cool. But yeah, I'll place two here, so then it's just... Supplies for gardens. Okay. What to do here? Let's see if I have artwork that I can place out. Essentially, that's a diner sign. Uh, what else? Oh, wait, the boxes. Maybe the boxes can be supplies or something. I don't really have anything else. I mean, that I feel like would look out of place. This might not. That looks like it's being sold. Uh, what else? I know this is a transportation stop, but there's a place here that sells garden supplies. They have this sort of thing where you sit down and... I might take this. We'll see how it can be customized. What else? Yeah, 
Yeah, that's too obvious. I'll take a look at my crafted stuff as well. Yeah? Okay. <laughs> I could just put... I'll see how it looks. I'll probably say no. I might use some of these. These are always good. Uh... Yeah, okay. Alright, let me check crafting real quick. thinking. Ah, uh, dude, this one, this one would be really nice. What do I need? I need cherry blossom bonsai and pine bonsai. But I don't think I have either of those. Let's see. Unless you can just buy them. I know I've used them in Happy Home, but I'm not sure if you're allowed to buy them from there. I might take a look. Not that I can do that today, but just to keep it in mind. I gotta go to Harv's anyway. Okay. So this is what I'm thinking. I might make a fountain as well, but like, uh, where is it? I've probably gone past it a million times. There it is. Yeah, so have a, this as a place where you sit and chill, and then I'll put some stuff in front of it. I think that'll work. So it'll have to be one back. Yeah. And then one more across, so it's not blocking. That works. I mean, already it kind of looks good, but I'll, I'll see what style it comes in. No, come on, there's room. That's not distracting at all, right? Yeah, you gotta you gotta buy some some plants and supplies. This is the sort of thing you you see. I'm not even kidding. I might leave it like that. I mean, what else am I gonna put there? Another thing that I, I just I won't explain. I'll just leave it like that. It's, you're browsing flowers, and then you're browsing other things when you face this way. It is kind of concerning that it is at eye level, but it's fine. I'm not sure if that's the scale.
I'm leaving it. <laughs> it's gonna be like that. It's just like my airport security, where no one's gonna understand the joke. Except maybe two people. To be fair, they do have statues. At least here, at garden statues, at places where you buy gardening supplies. To be fair. I'm not sure they would exactly have this one, but they do have statues. It's not completely out of place. Which one has soil? Uh, I mean, that's probably a good one too. They do here too. See? It's not out of place. There we go. Those of you that think I should remove it, for shame. It's on point with the theme. I mean, we won't get to see the back of it anyway. Okay, there's an ad for Circus Pietro on the back. It's a little Easter egg. Not that anyone will ever see it. Um, I may have to grind some Nook Miles now, because there's a couple of things I want to buy. First, let me see if I can buy the bonsai trees. Dog is huffing at you for making noise while he's trying to sleep. <laughs> That's funny. I've seen, like, a short video of, there's a man snoring, and then the cat gets out of bed, and just slaps the dude who's snoring. <laughs> oh, shit. We can go to a treasure island. Eh, it's fine. I'm trying to get everything myself without resorting to any of that stuff. Everything so far I've acquired. On my own, so. It's a nice to have, not like a, something that I'm desperately after. Right, use the search feature. Yeah, can't buy it. That's okay. I tried. Have? I think I have one of these. Not that I need it. Occasionally. 
Yeah, they would definitely be time savers for sure. <laughs> Especially if you can't find the item you're looking for. I guess this is just me, just... I wouldn't say being stubborn, just... Wanting to keep things... Where I've found everything myself. So I worked within the constraints of what I could find. I mean, that's fine, right? No. That's okay. Alright. Handcart. I mean, you know what? Maybe I won't even get that. No, no, no. Let me do this instead. I've changed my mind. I'm going to use these as garden lights. Gonna, this is gonna work out. So now I can place it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Now I'm on board with this. This will look good at night. I still have some, though. I'll go get the others out of storage, but I'm gonna do the same thing. It's Entry will have cube lights here and here. <laughs> Alright. Well, it's something. It will be great if I used all like 40 something cube lights that I purchased. And I can say, yeah, see, it was totally intended. I had a plan the whole time. So I guess with this done, then it comes time to clean up. I mean, I have a bunch of flowers. I have one of two choices. I can either take flowers and place them around the island, or I can pick three flowers, or four, and scatter only those around the island, and then keep the unique ones for, like, houses and stuff. So then the rest of the island has a consistent theme, so... I don't know, I haven't decided yet. I need to replace this fencing, this fencing is not good. Alright, but anyway, keep going. I gotta work on the house after this. pretty early. It's only seven here. I decided to start a bit earlier so then whatever I want to play next doesn't get... <laughs> its time doesn't get reduced because I play too much of this. Saturday, though, as long as you don't have to get up too early tomorrow. Oh, well, I guess it's Saturday for you now. Weekend! I'm 
am I am I just I'm one light short. I'm one cube light short. Uh oh no, no I'm not, no I'm not. Oh, okay. Yeah. Perfectly planned. <laughs> every I used every single light. Alright, cool. Um, I just need a found Well, okay. It's either this or I get a bigger fan. I might just stick to this. Like that's simple enough, right? I can change the color. I'm gonna change the color. Because again, it's a garden place, they sell fountains. Go with that one. Just so it doesn't blend in too much with the ground and it goes with. The, uh, the nice marble statue that you can totally purchase and place in your own garden. There we go. Alright, cool. I'd say that's good enough for this. Now for the house and in interior. I still got the garden gnomes that I've ordered overnight. I might see if I have any spare. Because it's possible that I didn't use all of them. Let's see. Yeah. I just needed a little bit of a layout change, so then I actually had space to play stuff, but it's good. Oh. Yeah, but they're too big. <laughs> they take up so much space. I didn't expect them to be that big. Oh, I do have one. Alright, um... I know this is a lot of back and forth, but I'm gonna go customize it. have them in your fairy garden. They are nice. I need to get some of the smaller butterflies. I have a couple, but it's just kind of gigantic. I mean, maybe, maybe I could do something with them. I'll get them out and see how I go. Here? I've lost track of it. <laughs> Where are they? There. Yeah, let's see. Maybe I can use them. for it to be here. Let's see. Yeah, it just it takes up so much space. Okay, hang on. But again, I'm doing the implied fence thing. 
If I can squeeze it in there, then it'll look good. I can reuse these hedges elsewhere, it's fine. Okay, uh... Where is it? That's the one. Yes, there is! Stop lying! <laughs> I love how it just perfectly goes into position after all that. Okay. Yeah. That works. Which... I guess at this point... Hang on. make better use of this. It does what it wants, that's it. Now it's that, you wanted to, to put something over there? Nah. I'm gonna make you fight for it. You gotta want it, you gotta first vacate the area. And then spend 30 seconds calculating your move before you can actually place it. I might even seal off back there. So then there's only one way out. Can this fit? This is the big question. No, I'm not trying to place it in the plaza. <laughs> I don't think... Oh, there's... Yeah, there's a hedge here. But I bet if I get rid of this hedge, it'll let me place it. Let's see. Okay, so... Oh! Yeah. That's good. All right, now. Like, even if it's a subtle background element, I think it's fine. Those trees are supposed to be decorative anyway. I'm not sure I can push it out any further. Push it any further out. Okay, that's fine. Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna go customize the gnome and then I'll start working on the interior. To Hobbs. Back to Hobbs. Hobbs at this point has probably made easily a million bells off me. <laughs> Quite the lucrative business he's in. Hands 
I might see if Leaf has other hedges, because I've got <laughs> limited colors now. Uh, Garden Gnome. Which one? Santa. Oh, what are those eyes? Uh, that doesn't look, like, sleepy to me. Hmm. Kind of like that one. That's pretty cheerful. It's between these two. Deprised and laid back. The color- I like the colors on Sleepy. I think it's just the face. It doesn't look sleepy to me. The colors are definitely good on Sleepy. I guess I need to find a pair, like... Which colors would work well? Yeah, probably... Probably these two. Just going back and forth between the colors. That one's too much like Santa. These have nice contrasting colors. This one's alright, but I feel like it's a bit vanilla. I'll, I'll order this one today, and then tomorrow I'll get that one. Although I think I have an, another one, so we might be able to get a third one. There's two more coming tomorrow, so... Okay, now I need to think about how I want this to look inside. There's two ways I can go. I can make it how it's a shop on the inside mixed with a house, or just make it a house. I'm kind of leaning more towards shop house, because I've done a bunch of houses lately, so... Okay. I don't care if you can't stand. Well, maybe I should allow it that they can stand behind the... Alright, I changed my mind. Okay, for now you can stay there. Alright, uh, before I do that interior, I'm going to just request the song that I need to request. So let me just quickly look at my song list and see what I don't have. I'm trying to bring up the list while still walking. Ah, there it is. Okay, so hold on. Uh, have that, have that, have that. Adventure, Aria, Ballad, then Bashment. KK Bazaar is next. Okay. That's the one I got to request. Mm 
I wish that you didn't have to spell it perfectly and I could just type bizarre and it would know. Okay. Okay. Um. B. A. Z. A. A. R. Hey, Star, how's it going? Thanks for the raid, by the way. I saw you were playing, uh, like a dragon. Otherwise, I would have popped in. <laughs> how's that going? I gotta get around to playing six and the other one. can put my thing down. How's my day going? Pretty lazy day. It's pretty warm outside, so I'm just kicking back. Decorating another house shortly. I just did all the exterior stuff. Haven't played in a week. Was lost for a bit. Digging it so far. Good game and story. Fun. Nice. Yeah, I'm looking forward to trying it out. I've heard a lot of good things about this one. Credits, GG. Yeah, go home, everyone. I'm done here. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> this is just the, the weekly song. You can request a song, and uh, he'll give you a copy of the song. It plays the credits every time you do this. But this is the culmination of, like, your goals initially. Is to get this dog to come to your island to play a concert, so... That's why it plays the credits. Curious to see how this song sounds on its own. Because the way he's playing it has no reflection on what the song actually sounds like. Oh. <laughs> I thought it was over for a sec. The museum area, I like it, but part of me wants to redo it. I just... <sighs> I have this sometimes where I'll make something, and then if I look at it a long time later, I won't be happy with it. Even though it's probably perfectly fine. I mean, the... crap. The thing that fell victim to that... I think this house here I redid like three times. But the final idea is, is great. It's just combining it with the house next door and it's a, it's a theme park. It worked. Okay, I need to go register the song and then I'll start decorating that house from the interior. But this is the final house, so after that, it's going around the island, cleaning things up, and I'm kind of approaching the end of what I want to do with this. I didn't type the song correctly. What? <laughs> ah, what? How's it spelled? B A Z double A R. What did I miss? A No. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Get this first. How did I spell it? Is he not gonna give me something now? 
It just says uncle. Ah, oh. what did he? What did he even play then? Yeah. Okay, good, 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 good. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> Let me double check. How's it spelled? K dot K dot. Okay. K dot. K. Space. B. A. Z. A. A. R. K dot K dot B. A. Z. A. A. R. Without question, I've spelt it correctly this time. <laughs> I swear, okay, well... I, I won't subject you to this again if, if for some reasons this is, this is still wrong. Okay, this is different. <laughs> I don't even know why I want all the music. What did I type last time? I don't know! <laughs> I thought I typed the right thing. I must have missed a dot or something. I'm gonna have to go back and look at the footage. I can't even blame that it's late at night. It's only 7pm. This is just like... Potentially an old man moment. I should just go to the store and get a cane. <laughs> yeah, maybe it was either maybe I missed a capital letter. I think it was a very minor thing, ultimately. This is very, um... Like, Arabic. It's something that you have to get it exact. Yeah, I wish you could just generally type bizarre and it would pick up on it. Oh damn, it's going crazy with the... It's just another one of those little things that the game doesn't do that well. Okay, without question, I've got it correct this time, right? Okay, good. Alright, I got it right. Now we can listen to how it really sounds like. Yeah, I mean, I like this little cafe thing. It's just, they're already running a cafe inside the museum. That's why part of me wants to redo it, but... I can't think of anything better right now. Alright, as expected. Okay, well, now I can go decorate the house. Uh, before I do, let's see if they're crafting.
So I, I didn't get the... Oh, wait, no, I did. It was cooking, wasn't it? Yeah. Okay, that's fine. See, I mean, it's already got a floral theme to it. But I'll do, uh... I'll do what I usually do, which is... It's gonna be a, a combination of a store and a house, so... I'll just sign into this so I get my... My Nook Miles. I guess this is it. This is the last one. I will adjust the roof of the one I did yesterday so it's green as well, but other than that... I don't think you can do two in one day, but I'll, I'll try. I think it's just one per day. Okay. Exterior first. Yeah, Daisy's great. I like... Just... She says bow wow. Yeah, I mean, wooden's probably good. Um... I mean, I feel like this makes sense for a garden center. But the stop was blue. No, well, it's good enough. Nice. There you go. Done. <laughs> she looks like a little grandma. I can see that. How does that look? Ah. Okay. I was trying to get it to look at night. How do you do night time? It's... Yeah, that. There we go. On this tab. Yeah. Okay, so theme of this, I'm gonna do a combination of a garden center and a place where she can live. Which, there's the thing, like, it's a bit of a downgrade for her because she's gonna lose the bed. What's that? Is that? Is that a flea? <laughs> when did she get a flea? I don't remember. Uh, I guess at some point. Alright. It doesn't matter. Alright. I'm gonna keep these. Okay. So. Let's work with this. what I have. It's kind of nice, but the pattern gets ruined. Hmm. Let me think. I mean... I think I can do something with this.
I'm just gonna set this up. Do that. Seeing what I have here. Okay. All right, all right. Now, yeah, maybe that one. It depends if this works or not, but. Oh, but I guess if I'll, uh, never mind. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> this might not be a bad idea. Hold on. I'm gonna work with this. It just depends if this layout works or not, but let's see. Uh, okay, so do that. Hey, Clive, thanks for the raid. How's it going? Jaden, Mikey. How's uh, your evening? I'm just chilling, decorating stuff in Animal Crossing. But I'm probably gonna do some some Wario later. I'm playing through this Wario game on the DS just because it's the only one I haven't played. It's a bit weird, but fun. You just finished Portal Revolution. Oh, cool. What are your thoughts on it? Clive is bad at Portal, is he? <laughs> I mean, if it's anything like the other one, those puzzles can get pretty tough. For a fan mod, it's impressive. Yeah, nice. Did you uh, struggle with any of the puzzles at all? Because with the other one, towards the end, ugh. Some of them were taking me, like, a good hour to get through, if not more. I think this might work. There's the brick one. Yeah, this. Lead all the way up. Okay, this is gonna work. And then do this. Three by two, three by two, two, three by two. Okay. There was one where you were spraying moon goo everywhere. <laughs> moon goo. Did the same to thing in total. I guess, yeah. I, just, I love the description being moon goo. But, but I mean, if it's moon goo, it's moon goo. Yeah, I'll, I'll have to check it out. It's like on my lengthy list of stuff to get around to eventually. I guess this would be, yeah, garden store. Let's move it one forward. I'm setting up this village to be a place that runs a gardening supply place. Okay. 
I'll make a little kitchen down the side. Yeah, I got that and Dredge. <laughs> Two games that I, I need to check out. I did get Dredge gifted for my birthday, so it's on the list. some of these kitchen things out. You know what? No, I'll go with this one. This one's nice. And it has a sink already. Yeah. I might change the back wall. <laughs> Just... As nice as that one is, it doesn't quite work. Like... Yeah, that's better. And I can kind of hide the windows. I think. Okay. Functional enough kitchen, that's all they need. Alright, now... Well, bedroom... It's gonna be a downgrade. Instead of a double bed, it'll be a single bed, but that's fine. That's what they had before, I'm gonna stick with it. Very compact living. Where is it? There's this thing that you put in a corner that has clothing. Oh. But see, that, that's the issue sometimes is I don't know what things are categorized as. It's so weird, they added search to one part of the game and not the rest of it. Okay, this we're definitely getting. This is part of... Part of what I had going on outside, so... Hang on. Oh, it doesn't matter what side? Okay, that's fine. Get uh, this. This is fine. <laughs> it's a tight squeeze, but you know what? It's fine. Okay. I'm gonna be lazy and put that on top of the fridge, and then this here. 
Maybe... Yeah, that's better. I'm doubting the carpet choice. What else do we have as an option? Wait, what doesn't that fit? Oh, it's three by two, that's why. So I can only pick a three by two. Cash register. Yeah, see, I have them available, <laughs> but I guess because I haven't found them yet. Cash register. Go with that. That's more classic. I'd call this a classic cash register and not a modern one. Uh, and then there's the... Where are they? The, uh, the box of starters. That's the one. Oh, that's nice. I think I was right the first time. It should be this. There we go. I'm almost done with the floor stuff. What else can we put that is ex you would expect in a garden store? I need a table. Oops, not that. <laughs> there we go. I think do this, and then... Just sell more little things, like, that's... Statues. <laughs> You're not wrong. Is it even available? <laughs> Doesn't fit. Could be like, yo, welcome to my store. But, I mean, they would have no way of... <laughs> Is it horrible that I kind of want to make this work? I feel like I could make this work. Like, if I do this... Oops. No, but do this, alright. I mean, this is this is functional. You can actually get in there. <laughs> what, is, what am I doing with my life, honestly?
Ah, uh, it's not functional. It needs just that. Now it's functional. I would like to say that this would become the YouTube thumbnail, but I feel like YouTube would not allow that. <laughs> Alright, look, I'll stop. But that being said, what I've done here I kind of like more, so... I'm gonna do the idea of statues, just not the gigantic one. There's smaller ones I can place that... Is this small? That is too big. That's a good one. That's a small one. <laughs> they kind of they kind of go together. All right. Then, hold on. Do like a reflection kind of design. Uh, what else? I mean, I should probably go for just the bag of soil. It's boring, but it works. Where is it? Going crazy. Where's the the bags? I think it's because they look plain and I'm probably going past it. Bag of soil, where are you? Oh, bags. It would have to be around here. Have them outside, so they definitely have to be in this list. There they are. Um, ah, there we go. Works for me. All right, now on to ceiling. Does it matter? It doesn't matter. Okay. Um, oh, but see, it's kind of in the way. I think I can still get it to work. Hold on. I got it. Needs to go inwards. I'll see if I can make this work the way I want it to. There's one thing I do well at, it's lighting.
Just off to the side, kinda. I don't think I can fit him in. Well, that's probably overkill. I think I just have to leave it like that. Okay. And the thing that every Australian this is essential with any house it's this it has to be you have to have that okay but now with this I can kind of put more of these around the place because we're selling them right but it doesn't have a different style Okay. It's good because they don't need to make too much sense. Alright, and I'm gonna go for my, my go to move. Not that. <laughs> Oh, it doesn't allow it. Is it really that big? It is. Okay. Uh, I really want this to work, so I'm getting rid of this. Okay, my go-to, which is... Just do a pattern with this. Not that color. Put one there. Okay, since this is different now, though, it should face that way. And then, since I can make a counter, okay. Just get a microwave. Out of all the houses I've done, I haven't given anyone a, uh, a washing machine. <laughs> kind of assume they're gonna go outside and just use rocks and the river or something. Where is it? I haven't given anyone that stuff. I bet it's in here. My kingdom for a search. There it is. We have an outdoor laundry area. I had one of those growing up. But here it's just like a European style one where it's hidden in a cupboard. The small apartment, they become more common. Okay, um, very last thing, lighting and soundscape. That's what we want. Probably go with warm lighting and just touch it down a scooch. Oh, in the game. Gotcha. <laughs> That's what you meant in real life. 
Um, I need to correct one error. I notice this one's not green. There we go. Alright, I think I'm done. It's a garden center. You can... person can live here if they want. Definitely functional. <laughs> Just a bit tight on space, but it does work. Uh, hold on. Just doing last minute adjustments. It's better. Alright, and then if I place you, this is how I get my thumbnail for later, place you here, gonna hide Tom <laughs> in the kitchen, okay, that's fine. Alright, camera... Get rid of that. I'll just leave it doing this for a minute so then I can find it easy later. Okay, so it's like almost at the three hour mark. Got it. There we go. Ah, I'm happy with this. Okay, I gotta go to talk, talk to Tom. Tom! Daisy, please. <laughs> That's it. That's all the houses. They have something going on. I'm gonna see if I can change the roof color of, uh... Let's see. Now it's just decorating the rest of the island, but I wanna see if I can change the roof color of what I did yesterday. Residence home. Yes. Oh, I think I can do it. Okay. Um, Melba. Oh, but I don't have the money. <laughs> Not now. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I need to get money out. All I'm doing is changing the roof color so it matches. That's all. I mean, I still have a lot of money, but it's a fraction of what I had before. A uh, residence home. More ideas. We are going after Melba. Okay, that, that's nice that it lets you do multiple in one day. Uh, but I've just been... I've just been doing one at a time. <laughs> Expensive change. Uh, exterior. Okay. 
I made the mistake. That should have been the roof color. That's that's it. Now it'll look good. Leave that as is. Okay, now it's done. <laughs> A, a slight oversight. Minor oversight on my part, but you'll see why. Pretty much, you, yeah, this. It should have been green. I, I didn't think about it. I just thought, oh yeah, that looks nice, and forgot that I have this here next to it. That'll work out nicely. Yeah, cool. Oh, are you crafting? Overall, I'm pretty happy with what I've done. I tried to mess around more with lighting on this one. Alright, I need to find out who's making stuff today. So, I mean, now it's just stuff around the island, which there's a bunch of things I need to fix. Primarily, I don't know, the fact that there's flowers everywhere and I don't need them. I have a few adjustments that I want to do to this theater, but in general, this is fine. I'm going to put some seats here, so then this is like a waiting area along the wall. This has... it's going to take six months in total. Everything has taken six... six months. What are you making? Ah, uh, do I have this? This is probably one of the largest customization things I've done in a while. I know it already. I like Alice's house. I mean, there's supposed to be a kitchen here, but surprisingly that coincidentally worked out. That's where her crafting bench goes when she's crafting, so that's... That worked out <laughs> pretty well. Intentional, of course, as always. We only do things intentionally here. Let me sell the junk I have on me. Oh, this, I mean... These are spares now, I don't think I'm gonna use them. And they're basic flowers anyway, so if I do want them back, I can grow them. 
There's always a way for me to go back, though. So it's fine. Oh, I forgot one. Alright, now I need to think about what I'm doing after this. As annoying as it might sound, <laughs> I think. I've been putting it off. But I need to start clearing... Clearing all this out. I think the way I need to decide... I'm gonna bring this green one with me. Now that every house has flowers on it, but I have to make a choice, which is generally speaking around. Oh my god, it lags so much. Generally speaking, around the island, if I should just stick to a small variety of flowers or. I should uh, try to do something fancy. I'm kind of leaning towards having a set, set color palette, and then eventually just lining things up. This I'm going to redo. This is now an area that I need to rethink. There's a fruit stall here. Um, I'm going to rethink it. 3 a.m. You're going to sleep. All right, no worries, Zana. Well, thanks for uh, popping in and for the chat. Have a good rest of your night. I want more green. It's also, I guess. I'm gonna do this so I can start thinking. Good luck with everything. Thank you. <laughs> I probably won't do much more. And I'll start doing the next game, so you're not gonna miss out on anything. I'm just gonna put a path down so I can think about this. I wanna make like a camp area, so that's what I'm gonna do now. Just lay down a path. Gotta be something that curves a little. Um, communal camp area is the idea. completely interrupt what I'm doing there, so let's just... This is very loose. I don't know if this is even worth doing. I guess let's see. It might be. I'm not sure. Uh, hang on. Just thinking about it. 
could be here or here. I think it's here. I want it to be interesting, so I'm gonna do this. Alright, I mean, loosely, yeah. But then, it would continue. This is the part that I need to rethink as well. It's just what I'm gonna do here. I like that the rocks are up here, but I may have to ditch them. I'm not sure. I'll figure it out. Alright, but this, at the very least, is correct, what I want to do. I guess I'm, I'm gonna get one item. I'm not gonna start this now, but I'm going to get one item so then I know how this looks like. I think it's just made out of hardwood, but I can't be sure. Wood and a campfire, tree branch. Okay, tra tree branch, campfire, got it. I went saving and then not. Ugh, I was supposed to pick the other thing. <laughs> Do I want to? Because I don't want to start it up again. Sometimes I do that. I press minus when I mean to change into normal. I want to finish my train of thought, otherwise, it's going to bother me. So we're going to have to eat a loading screen here. Yeah, good. <laughs> I like the part where we all have to sit in a loading screen for a whole minute. Because I don't know how to control a game that I've only been playing for like, I don't know, 300 hours. I want to say it's 300. I would imagine it's something like that. <laughs> I'm sorry. My bad. Look who's back. Alright. Yeah, I was supposed to just go back to regular. Man, this this part looks so nice now. Alright. Uh go to craftable campfire. And the big one. I may purchase, like, another tent as well, just to kind of flush that area out a bit more. I don't think I can today, because I've used all my purchases, but... So the idea is... Of course it's clay. There we 
Ah. There we go. Communal camp area. So that's loosely the idea. I'm probably going to put another tent here. I'll put some seating here. Um, I don't know if I can get something that looks like a picnic table. Um, seating here, seating here, seating here. But you get the idea. That's the picture I have in my head, so hopefully that helps sell it a little. Hey! <laughs> there we go. I'm such a terrible shot. Since I can't do much here, I'll probably just plant this here. It's a spare, so may as well. There we go. But yeah, I'll think about it more. Not sure about this apple tree. It's kind of in a place where there's not really anything. The other thing I was debating on, what, like, whether or not to use these trees or use pine trees. So start the pine trees here, and then they kind of... Sort of makes sense. I don't know, I associate pine trees more with camping. I'll let... I'll let that idea... Just simmer for a bit. Then, yeah, I gotta think more on this. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I got an idea. As nice as this is on the beach. Okay. But then what would I do with this? Because this is nice to have all the trees in one spot. But I kind of already have that. Like, well, this is the place where there's the fruit trees. They're all here. Do I, do I really need them? Not really. I could turn I could turn this into a market set up the fruit stall set up this in there set up the fish set up this and then that would clear the way for setting up this we're here like over here and actually set up seating so it's still fish and chips on the beach but it's something that has dedicated seating as well and then here I could probably put, like, some of the other missing farm items, like tractor, silo, whatever. It might flow better. I could even maybe move some of the fruit trees to this area. The more I say it out loud, the more I'm leaning towards it. Like, I could do fruit tree... Fruit tree, fruit tree, fruit tree, and keep it pretty simple. Okay, I'll I'll sit on that idea a little more. I'm kind of leaning into it. Yeah, 
I'm, I may have to do this. Because then I could join it with this, and you could... I remove this, this hedge, and then have the path continue downwards. So you can get through the market and get to this part easily. <sighs> Alright. <laughs> I'm going to stop now. After I get this balloon. Before I create too much work for myself, but... Much like what happened with, um... Oh, right, I don't have a slingshot. It's dead. I can't make a slingshot. I have to get wood out. And it might be gone by then. I'll try, but... What is it? It's like softwood and iron? Do I have one, maybe? No. Okay. Softwood, and... where is it? No, it's hardwood. <laughs> it's gonna be gone by the time I make it. Okay, I've, I've only been playing this game a few hundred hours, it's fine. Alright, please still be around. Flying over in this direction, so. Oh, it's still there. Okay, cool. Not a waste of time. never gonna hit. What is going on? Hey. There we go. There's also a big fish here. I haven't done any fishing this month, so maybe let's just, just in case, do this. Okay, I mean, it was a big fish, but I already have plenty of these. Decided to play a little bit extra because <laughs> going back to menu. I didn't want to just return to the game and not play it. Ugh, not play it. I guess while I'm here. thinking what would look good for Scoot. I mean, I think as basic as this is, I think this works. Let's see if I can make that vertical board fence green or something.
Ja. Just I'm not using that original one that I had. Yeah, that's fine. That works. Going with what Scoot has. Much better. Small touch, but it goes a long way. All right. I think that's. I think that's it. I think I've gotten rid of all the. Well, that fencing type. I think it's all gone now. If I'm not wrong. So all my place, all the fencing is gone. At least for the villages areas, like I think it's all done. I'll have a look. I'm pretty certain. Yeah, I think it's all gone now. Which, good. <laughs> I mean, there's nothing wrong with that fencing, it's just because I use it everywhere and it just looked bland. I gotta pop in and say hey to them, so then ups friendship level. Oh, you're cooking. I already got someone crafting. Do they craft and cook? Oh, man, that means I could have got another recipe. Oh well. <laughs> Damn. Well, now I know. Hey, Bizarre Abyss. Thank you for the raid. How's it going? I guess I gotta check everything. <laughs> said hi to everyone. I need to be better with that. <laughs> I haven't really focused on talking to the villagers every day. But if I want any of their photos, I think I need to start doing that. Alright, but I've definitely used all the, uh, the original fencing is gone now, so that's good. Okay, well, I'm gonna think more on this. But the next thing is probably gonna involve a lot of moving flowers, or getting rid of them, cleaning up. I have some ideas floating around, so I'm gonna let them simmer for a bit. But I got the feeling I'm probably gonna do the, uh... The whole thing of making like a little market area and just not really caring about fruit trees too much, but leave that with me. I'll I'll think about it.
Um, so I'm gonna swap games now, but, uh, yeah, it was fun doing some Animal Crossing and chilling. If you are checking this out later on as a replay, thanks for sticking around to the end of the video. And if you do want to support any other content over on YouTube, the easiest way to do so is just click the like button. Holy crap, the loading. The like button, subscribe, uh, I don't know, whatever it is YouTubers typically tell you to do. Uh, any of that stuff does help. I do appreciate those people that do do that. Also, watching other videos of mine by clicking whatever pops up helps as well. So, hope you do check it out. We'll do more of this soon, so, yeah, stay tuned for more, uh, renovation stuff.